A small glimmer of hope for global shipping as renewed efforts to refloat the huge vessel stuck in the Suez Canal could see it freed within days. This according to the Dutch firm working to dislodge the container ship using a combination of heavy tugboats, dredging and high tides. On Saturday, the chairman of Egypt's Suez Canal Authority said that the stern and the rudder of the ship had started moving on Friday night, but added that he could not lay out a set timetable for freeing the ship. He did, however, shed some light on the cause of the grounding. It might have been a technical human error which will be revealed through the investigation. Many errors might be the cause, but we cannot prove anything yet. The only clear cause is that there were strong winds and a sandstorm, but this is not the only one, as others will be revealed during this investigation. The maritime traffic jam caused by the stranded ship has grown to more than 300 vessels. About 15% of world shipping traffic passes through the canal and currently the grounding is holding up some $9.6 billion worth of cargo each day between Asia and Europe. If the fresh attempts to refloat the ship are unsuccessful, hundreds of containers will have to be removed from the front of the vessel to lighten it, making it easier to pull free.